Yo, what it do, what it does, Wagwan Wagwan. My name is Shem Wikia, and today we have a guest who may not require any introduction, Mr. Oh, na 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 himself. Yes. Uh, how are you doing today? Yes, we're giving thanks to life, health, and strength, every living thing that moves it and keep it up on the face of the earth. Let them hear the king right now. We are right here in Kenya. You mm. don't know. Yes, yeah. to be. Okay, so we're yeah. here with uh, Richie Spice. And, um, okay, so let me just ask, as you know, like, so most of the time when you people come to Kenya, we teach them some Swahili. Good. So, um, I want to, sh- uh, uh, during the press conference, someone said Niaje to you. Yeah? Niaje, yeah. Niaje. So Niaje means like, what's up or wagwa. Yeah, what's up, yeah. Then you say, poa, poa. Poa, poa. So I'm wondering. I mean, good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm wondering if you can teach me, in Jamaica, it's called Jamaican Patwa. Patwa, yeah. Yeah, I'm wondering if you can teach me something I can say in Jamaican Patwa. Uh, jo- in Jamaica, Patwa, no, we want to say, um, um, blessed love our no, ja- Blessed na- lover. No, nah, uh, Jamaican patwa now. Give me something now. Jamaican patwa. Ah, ah. He want me teach him something in Jamaican patwa. I want to be. I want to. I want to learn. To we are going. Yeah. Okay. All right. Big up yourself. Where are you going with? Yeah. Where are you are going with? Me, mean, mean. You, you're okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. So, um, you um, you're going to be performing at the concert tomorrow. tomorrow yes. Nobody, nobody can, can stop, stop reggae. reggae yeah. And nobody can stop reggae is a thing a lot of people say. Like it's a it's a phrase that's out there. And I'm just curious. Do you know where this? Like, wh- how did people start saying nobody can stop reggae? Well, um, I guess I don't know, but I <laughs> guess that um, people always the, the reggae reggae is a music where in which means is a foundation music where mm-hmm. in which. A lot of other music arrived from, mm-hmm. yes, but all the other type of music that come up, reggae still always on top. Okay. Yes, yeah, so yeah. probably that's, that's the reason why them say nobody can stop reggae. Nobody you know? can stop reggae. Yeah. So, um, as Richie Spice, uh, you've been in the music industry for like a long time. I grew up listening. Like there's so many songs as mm-hmm. I was going through your music um, that I found out I used to hear even when I was growing up. Yeah, yeah. So you've been doing music for a really long time, and I'm mm-hmm. just curious to find out how do you stay driven because you've consistently been d- releasing music since like the 90s good so how you stay driven well i mean we keep our we, we will all focus you know we focus on what we're doing and um we love what we do mm-hmm. yeah so i mean it give us that drive because um you know you have that passion for what you do you know yeah so you just keep on doing mm-hmm. yeah so coming from like coming from a very musical family, did you ever want to do anything else, or you always knew you were going to be a musician? No, I never always want to um, know I was going to be a musician. You always knew yeah. you were going to be a musician. No, I never always know. No. I try a, a lot of other things. Like for you example, know, I used to be like um, a post that I used to try. I used to learn, trying to to to, to learn this um a post that trade. A post trade. A post trade, yeah, like a post that chair. Yeah, 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 yeah but. Yeah. I went that far, you know, and learned to make up the frame and everything. The yeah. frame it, the, the, the put in the something at the spring, the spring. I used to use spring springs, so you spring it up and yeah. So that and, so you and, and, and you wrap the cloth over it before you put on the finishing. Yeah, you know, but I reached that far. Mm-hmm. But uh, this like I, I, I leave on a weekend and 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 go back the Monday morning. You know, I'm supposed to go, you know, and start to cover now. Cover the, cover the cover, chairs. Yeah, so finish me then now so I can start make me one chair and start earn my own money. Uh-huh. So at the time when I reach now, I said the brother who used to teach me, leave the job. Uh-huh. Yeah, so it was a big disappointment. So I leave from there and you know, I never try it back again because I never really go somewhere else where we could have said, um, you know, um, further it. Just leave it there. So, so did you move into music right after that? Yeah, I think so, you know, because I tried a lot of things after, before I used before. to do, start yeah. the opposer. So the opposer was the last one. That was the last one you were like finding. Yeah, I'm just leave it. Yeah. Yeah, and then, you know, we still hustle, hustle around and, you know, buy a tape recorder and mm-hmm. right the first time it was cassette, like, you know, and I've written pan it where, you know, we practice and practice and practice and, mm-hmm. you know, until yeah. it's what it is, you know. Okay, so do you play, like, do you play any instruments? Like, mm, just probably drums. Drums, time, yeah. yeah. Okay, so um, there's something that people had touched on during the press conference about um, like Rastafari and you said how people assume a lot of things, which is true. A lot of people are very ignorant about what it means to be mm-hmm, Rastafari, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. myself included. So I want to know like, from your perspective, what does it mean to be Rastafari? What does it mean to be Rastafari right now? It's mean to be me, mm-hmm. you know? A Rastafari is me, mm-hmm. you know, whole life, you know, is a, is a way of life. 
you know so the way I, I live you know that is Rastafari yeah. to me mm -hmm. you know I don't know else to describe it I mean if you if you if you if you read up on um if people really want to know many more things about, about Rastafari. Rastafari you know you read you read books of um mm -hmm. with um Emperor Celestia mm -hmm. you know and because Emperor Celestia was a man who mostly um was a Rasta mm -hmm. you know so you get a lot of teaching from it yeah and even more than what me can tell you because it's written you know it's written down yeah so just one question that i have is is it like is it a religion on its own or is it like a it's not a religion it's, 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 it's a, a way of it's life it's a way of life yeah okay yeah. all right that makes sense and then um bec earlier you mentioned that ma uh, marijuana was decriminalized in jamaica mm -hmm. how long t how long ago was that has it been was it recent or has it been a really long time it's it's not very long in about about three years Years. Yeah, about three years now. So how, like, because um, Rastafari is related uh, a lot, some they relate it to the herb mm -hmm. and everything, and people smoke the herb. Mm -hmm. Like, how are you guys surviving in the country as Rastafari, and it was illegal? When it was illegal? Yeah, when it was illegal. Yeah. Well, <laughs> bravery. <laughs> brave man, and, you know, people still, you have farmers that plant them, them <laughs> MRB same way. Yeah. You know, and um, you have people who, smoke them weed same way yeah you know people get lock up still but you know they, they couldn't stop it mm -hmm. you know people drive with them weed and smoke them weed same way you know mm -hmm. okay all right um so um from watching like some of the performances you've done like just online mm -hmm. you don't really have like so much energy um when you're on stage um what would you say is one of the things you really enjoy about performing to an audience so that again i didn't get that um you. what do you enjoy about performing on stage you know like when you're performing well, what I really enjoy is the people, you know. Yeah. Yeah, to see the people full joy and be yourself. Mm. Yeah, it make me feel happy, you know. Mm. Yeah. Okay. All right. And like, um, do you th do you how long do you think you're gonna be doing music for? Do you think you're gonna do music forever? For life. For life. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I'm not walking. I'm shaking. Like <laughs> shaking at the studio. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so like, with the concert that's going the the concert that's coming up tomorrow, what can the audience expect from? Well, you? the audience can expect pure music. New music, old music, music young, music middle age, mm -hmm. you know, mm -hmm. real music, man. Just music. Yeah. Okay. So Full band is here. Yeah. Everyone is here. Everyone is happy. Mm -hmm. You know. Um, probably they might going out to sound check shortly. Mm -hmm. You know, mm -hmm. go line, do line check and set up the whole mm -hmm. vibe for tomorrow. Make sure you're prepared. Yeah, everything. prepare. But we are here, prepare and ready, man. You're already ready. Full of vibes, so you if know. If the concert was to start now, you're good. Right away. <laughs> you're good. You're ready, right <laughs> away. Right <laughs> away. Right <laughs> away. Okay. Um, another question <laughs> I have is, um, I've, I've, if I'm not wrong, you're involved in uh, a foundation called um, Food for the Poor. Food for the Poor. So how did how did you end up being involved in that uh, in that movement? Ah, uh, you know, say. The whole link come to um, the music team, element music team, you know, mm -hmm. music group and thing. or link up together and, you know, join up mm -hmm. to the organization. To like to give back to the... Yeah, to give back to poor people, you know. Right. Um, one last question I have about Rastafari, though, is um, I've noticed, like, you guys always give thanks. Like, it's always give thanks for this. When someone asks you something, it's give thanks. Is that part of something that... Y is, is that part of the the way of life to always be thankful yeah you always have to be thankful you know because you wake up this morning and you see the sunlight mm -hmm. you see the whole atmosphere blowing you know mm -hmm. you, you, you have heat here and water mm -hmm. you know you live in so you have to give thanks you, to give thanks. you know yeah. real all right so personally as myself i'm i'm a reggae fan but i'm not like a reggae head you know mm -hmm. so i want to find out from you know one of the living legends of reggae so other than yourself what are some recommendations you would give to someone like me who wants to get m into listening to more reggae? To listening to more yeah, reggae? Like who, which artist do you think I should listen to? Or like who, would I, who should I start with? Uh, well, I think the way to go is to listen to righteousness, you know. Mm. And righteousness means consciousness. You know, I mean, consciousness means positivity. You know, because it's good for a young man to stay positive mm -hmm. in life because that helps you to grow up, raise a, raise a family yeah. positively. You know, so the type of music that you listen, you grow your, your children and it's same way, so everybody come up positive. Mm -hmm. You know, because negativity is not a good thing at all, at all. Yeah. 
you know? so, 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 so I look for, so I should look for the positive music, but I feel like a lot of almost, other than when it touches on social injustice and everything like that, I feel like all reggae music is positive. Well, you have some negative in other world things still, you know? Yeah. Some not really negative, you know? In, like, but like, like, like you just say no. Because people classify the, 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 the music, yeah, they, they, they split the music in our two things where they say dance hall and reggae. Okay, yeah. Yeah, but it's one music, which is reggae music coming out of Jamaica. Oh, okay. But it's split now, so the people them will do like the dance hall music. Now you have all the parties out there who do good music. Yeah. But you have some way who, you know, it's the same way, do some stupidness sometimes, you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that, I was all the stupidness is the thing that you have to stay away from. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> all right then. Okay. Um, so uh, I want to thank you so much for giving us this time. Mm -hmm. um, uh, bless up so much. Uh, since we're live on Facebook, I just mm -hmm. want to enter Facebook a bit. I see if the audience, what the audience is saying, or yeah. if they have any questions, if there are any shout outs. Mm -hmm. uh, but for in the meantime, as I'm doing that to keep them occupied, because yeah. I know they'd, I know they'd love to hear you sing. Yes. Well, yeah. to all the people out there that are listening right now, you don't know. Look out for Richie Spice's new album mm -hmm. coming out this year. Yes. At you. The single is out there right now entitled Beautiful Life. Yeah, could you, yeah, could you, so sing, could you sing a bit? We can soar to the fire, the sunset, here tonight. Give me more, let me swim to the ocean to your eyes. We can dream, we can dream, we can dream for paradise. I can dream, I can dream, I can dream to be by your side. Well, oh, it's a beautiful life. Yeah, it's a beautiful life. One sky, one night, two hearts, one life. Oh, it's a beautiful life. With you tonight. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, na, 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 na. Hey, na, 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 na. Even when we pull up. We should just have that concert today. Let's just have the concert today. Let's just have the concert right now. <laughs> <It's amazing. laughs> All right, so um, we've got a gentleman who goes by the name of, um, whoa, sorry, uh, Yakuza Ezra saying, what a Guan Richie, my people. Um, Sean Bean says, um, busy man always in town. How many times always have you been in, in Kenya? Where's the hour ago? Oh, I've just been in Kenya. How many? Like, how many times? Um, how, many been? Oh. Yeah, how many times? Have you this is like the third time, you know. Third time. Yeah, so we are seeing literally to right now. Mm -hmm. You know, we're in, we know it's so right here now. Kenya now is our home now. All right. Yeah, homebound. All right. Um, Honorable Lucheng says, bless. Um, Stabs Mumbi says, one love, Richie Spice, all the one way from love. Zambia. Watching bless. all the way from Zambia. That's that. Um, Yegon Geoffrey says, Gideon Boots and a khaki suit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Young uh, Babylon, do her. Yeah. Uh, and Steve Musa says, bless I and I. So last, yeah. Uh, Yakuza Ezra one, one time again saying, big up Rasta, mad respect. Rasta love. Uh -huh. uh, George Kanyora saying, Richie Spice, big up. Ja bless, welcome to Kenya. Big up, bless. Rasta um, love. And Mars Jr. says, welcome, Sana Rasta man. And Peter S. General says, uh, he loves Richie Spice. There's so much love going yeah, on yeah, in man. the Enough audience. Enough love, enough respect. Every time, you don't know. Mm -hmm. You know, the love is always here, you know. From Richie Spice, from Richie Spice. You know, just like how the whole of Kenya love Richie Spice, you know? Yeah. Yeah. Push back the love, same way, you know? That's right. Exactly. Kenya loves Richie, Richie yeah. loves Kenya. Yeah. That's what's up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, man, Richie Spice, thank you so much for yeah, giving man, us the time of day, man. Um, we're anxious yeah, for the concert tomorrow. I know it's going to be amazing. Yeah, man. Respect. Um, bless her. Bless her. Yeah. Right. yeah. yeah. Huh? Oh?